Hey guys, Darth Glork here, back with part four of our Moemon Platinum playthrough. So, last time we uh, got team members three and four of our team, and so now we are four official members strong. And at least for now, that's they will remain on the team, but uh, they have been very useful additions so far. Uh, we also managed to reach gym number three, I believe, and it is a ghost gym, and it kind of scared us, to be honest. Uh, I was nervous that I would not be able to beat her, and so now I actually have a, I have an explanation to offer my, all, all of you. So, uh, I alluded to the fact at the very end of the last episode that we probably would need to grind. Okay, well, I actually questioned how true that was. So, last night, I actually tried to record uh, this, part four. Tried to record part four. Here's the thing. A, my commentary wasn't there. I was too tired from work, and my commentary was not great. So, that was the first problem. The second problem was uh, we actually started to work our way through the ghost gym just to see if we could force, like, you know, bludgeon our way through. <laughs> like, to see if I could make it work. Um, and uh, we couldn't. So... We beat all the little trainers inside, that was no problem, but, and then we got to the actual gym leader and we fought her like four or five times, and then I was like, alright, clearly this isn't gonna work. So, so that's so, unfortunately I had to scrap the footage because my commentary was crap, and then on obviously, like I said, we couldn't beat the gym, and I only went like 15 minutes. So, right, so the only thing you guys have missed is me beating all the little trainers inside the gym. Um, and so, that's what happened with the lost footage. Now, off camera, and so uh, after that didn't work out, I'm like, okay, well clearly my commentary is not good, so I'm not gonna put out a put out put out a video today. I would rather not put out anything than put out bad content, right? So I didn't put anything out. Now, um, so then instead, off camera, I grinded. So now our team is higher level than they were. Uh, first, I gave a level, we got Lexi one level higher, uh, no new moves or anything, but she is 31 now rather than I think it was 29 and 30 was the last time you guys might have seen her. Uh, I think it might have been 29, so I got her to 31. Um, now this is the big one, is our little, uh, level 1 dragon thing, whatever it was, the, the first evolution of the dragon whose name escapes me, um, evolved, actually. We gave her quite a few levels, and we got her to 27, uh, and she evolved to the middle tier of her of her specific evolution. So that's really cool. No new moves, uh, but her stats are obviously starting to get kind of juiced. So her physical attack is pretty stinking good. And uh, now Dragon Rage hits very hard, and it hurts quite a bit. So uh, yeah, so Dragon Rage, you know, hits pretty hard, and it hurts quite a lot. Although really quick, though... Uh, is this a physical move or a special move? Is that- will you not show me? Why not? Okay, I think it's special, maybe? So that's unfortunate, because obviously she's a physical attacker, and her stats reflect that, so that's less than ideal. But anyway, got her to 27, we got Reyna to 27 as well, um, and then we just gave Astrid the EXP share, and I don't remember where she was. I don't know if she was at 20 when you guys saw her, or if she was a little higher than that. Or if she was at 21 or whatever, but she is 22 now, uh, holding the EXP share, because everyone else was higher, was higher than that. So, anyway. So that's what happened, is we did, I did grind, and, uh, and we, yeah, and we beat all the little trainers inside this gym. So, so today, the goal here, the, you know, the hope and the prayer, is to be able to make it through the gym. So, you know, if we're really dreaming, that's what'll happen. Because my, my idea here is, alright, first of all, I think it's a circle, but I need to see. Yeah, circle, okay. So, could you, could, could you, could you move? Could you, could you move? Take a step back, Karen. Step back. That's what I thought. Anyway, um, anyway, and so, uh, and so, yeah, I lost my train of thought. So basically, I wanted to get everyone else a uh, higher level, because I needed them to be able to support Lexi more, because originally I was having Lexi kind of brute force her way through uh, in an effort to try and pass. I'm looking for that little tile on the floor. There it is. Uh, heart. Okay. Uh, that's the sun. It's a bullseye. There's a moon. There's a star. Alright. Anyway. But uh, I needed the... I, my idea was if I raised everyone else's levels... Uh, let's give that a save now that we're in front of her. Anyway, but my idea was if I raised everyone else's levels, maybe they could support Lexi so that Lexi wouldn't have to fight the whole thing on her own. 
So that's kind of the hope, honestly, and that's kind of what we're shooting for. So I'm thinking that let's go ahead and have, I think she's still in front. Yeah, Haley's still in front. So let's have her in front. Let's see if she can Dragon Rage or Dragon Breath. I, I always forget which one she has. Uh, but if she can use her Dragon Move and see if she can get through at least one of them. Uh, because if, if Lexi could be saved, because the reason we're, we're not passing it, so... This lady has three Pokemon. The first two are not, are not a big deal. Originally, I was uh, Lexi can take both of them without without too much too much issue. Um, but the issue is the third one, and I already forgot the name of it. It's like it's like Magnanimous, but that's not how you say it. I know it's not. It's like it's like Madge Animus or something. It might not be how you say it. I don't know. Anyway, so she has a third ghost, and that ghost is a pain. It has a grass move. Um, so it, it annihilates, it annihilates, uh, isn't, isn't it Reyna? Isn't that our glass, uh, no, isn't that our water? Yeah, so she, the, the, her third ghost has a grass move that annihilates Reyna. Um, she has Psybeam, so that annihilates Lexi. So Lexi can hit hard, but if she gets hit, it's pretty nasty. Um, and so it's like, it's kind of a pain, so she has, it feels like she has an answer for all of us. So I'm hoping if maybe, if we're really dreaming, maybe Haley can take the first two, and then maybe Lexi can steamroll her way through the third one. If we do more damage, maybe we'll get lucky. I, that's kind of what we're just going to hope for here, so we'll just, we'll just have to see. Ho ho ho! Finally you have arrived. Since I came to this country, I always try to learn new things. They hold contests in this city. I say to myself, something in French, and I will excel. That is why I dress this way. More words in French. Also, I study Pokemon very much. I have come to be gym leader, and uh, so it shall be that you challenge me. But I shall win. That is what a gym leader does, no? Yeah, that's, uh, that's not always the case there, Fantina. Also, spill water all over myself because I am an adult and I can't drink out of a cup even when it's I guess I guess I need a straw because I can't drink out of a cup you have to tip anyway that's science I guess anyway hang on I, my eyes I feel like there's something in both of my eyes what's up with that dragon rage that's what it is it is dragon rage so we're just gonna see man we're just gonna do what see what happens well we almost got the duskull like in one in one move Super Potion, because they think they're funny. Hit it again! I don't know why there's no, like, sound of actual, like, the damage hitting. It's just silent when they blink. I don't know, really... Un or the fainting noise. Like, I don't know why that's gone. There's the future sight. There's the damage noise. Alright, we're back. Isn't this- I think this is that roided out Pokemon. That's weird. This is not the order that I fought them in originally. Uh, Haunter is supposed to be her second one, but she's already sending out her big bad one. That's confusing. Should we switch to... Should we switch to Lexi and have her try and take this one and right out of the gate? Or should we try and see if Haley can do something? But let's go ahead and stay in. Let's see if Haley can do something. That's really weird. This is not the order that she was originally in. Let me do I mean, obviously I'm hearing sound, so I don't really get... Because I, I did mute the audio yesterday. When I was grinding. Yeah, I don't really get why it's why it's doing that. But anyway, um... Yeah, I guess what is this? Yeah, Shadow Ball. That was the other one. That's the other one that, like, annihilates you. It hurts a lot. Wow. Bailey's a tanky, is a tanky, tanky girl. Oh, man. She had that thing's health. And it has a berry that's going to heal it back to at least, like, 75%. Eh, not quite, but almost. Survive this! Survive it, Haley! Don't die! Oh, that's unfortunate. I would have heard if you didn't die, but alright, whatever. Okay. Please don't one-shot me. Give me at least two hits from that. Alright, well, I will survive one more. <laughs> As you can see, this is why this 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 is why this thing annihilates us. Wow, Lexi just does not do. And a super potion. Could you stop healing, please? I can't keep up when you when you heal. <laughs> I need you to not heal. If you could stop healing, actually, that would be that would be ideal. Hit him again. Oh. So yeah, we're still getting annihilated is the is the long and short of it. I'm still alive. I can't believe it. I wonder why there's no impact guys. Wow, we got it! We didn't do that the first time. And here's the Haunter. I wonder if Raina could take it. Mm -hmm. 
It's so weird to me why there's no, there's no... Yeah, it's like there's there's no, like, it's like, it's like half the noises are, like, half the sound is gone. I don't really understand why. Should we go Rain Dance and then Water Pulse? Do you think Raina will survive getting hit even one time? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, Shadow Claw. That's, that's, an... oh, okay, well, it doesn't, it doesn't do very much. All right. Okay. So there's the Rain Dance. That'll help our Water Pulse. Now if we get now, Raina, don't get critted or anything, alright? Thank you. Uh oh wow. Yeah, it's pretty good. One more hit. It'll she'll probably heal, but. Never give up, never surrender. Yeah, yeah, you and your needs. So there's the impact noises for me, but why don't I have impact noises? Come on! Wow, we beat her! I can't believe it! So yeah, that grinding made all the difference. It's because, uh... Hey, 23 for Astrid. How about that? Anyway, we beat her. You are so fantastically strong, I now know why I have lost her. Something like that. She talks very quickly. I am dumbfounded. So very, very strong, you and your Pokemon. So strong. Your power is admirable. I shall honor it with this gym badge. Hey! Badge number three, baby. Yeah, so that grinding made all the difference because, uh... Our third Pokemon that names escapes me. Hidden move Defog outside of battle. Well, that's interesting. That's a new one. Anyway, gave me a TM as well. But yeah, so uh, that our Dragon type, uh, Shadow Claw. Very startling move it is. Its moves turn critical often. Boy, they sure do. Haley. It's because Haley actually pulled like really pulled her weight this time. That was why that was so different. Well, that was cool. We did it. Yeah, that grinding made all the difference. And uh. Even cute little Reyna managed to stay and, you know, managed to get, get a kill. She got the Haunter, so... Yeah, man, that little bit of grinding I did made all the difference. Heal me. I'm in pain. Alright. I have little candies in front of me. Mambas, they're called. So if you have Mambas near you, have some. Have a Mamba. They're very good. They're a little juicy, little fruity candy. And they're great. Also, happy Saturday, everybody. Hope you're having a good weekend. As you can see by the in-time in and really accurate to my zip code clock, it is, uh, you know, at my time zone, I mean. It's very early. I mean, for me, it's not early. I've been up for, I've been up for almost four hours now. So for me, it's for me, it's not early. I just get up early because my work is really early. And so even on weekends, I still get up early. And that's not out of like I set an alarm. I just wake up before my before my alarm would have rung because my body thinks it's funny to not allow me to sleep in. Anyway, uh, we probably could just keep her in front for now. We could just keep the team like this for now. Well, I mean, we got her, so we can. I can't. I still. I'm still kind of in shock, to be honest. But we can move on. We need to give this a save because I don't want to have to fight that stupid ghost chick again. All right, beautiful. Well, now we got options, left or or right. Oh, this is one of the places that has a thunderstorm. Let's go this way. Hang on. Oh, it's look. It's Barry. Do you think Barry, Barry, quite contrary, is gonna want to fight? Hang on. Hey, nerd. I mean, friend. Ta-da! Kept me waiting again, Scarlet. We'll see how much stronger you and I have gotten right here and now. Hey, you're a trainer now. You're expected to be ready for a battle. No whining, no waiting. Let's get the show started. I didn't whine, you little gnat. He has four Pokemon now. Well, level-wise... It's pretty close. Uh, Sandstorm doesn't hit very hard, but I think Rock is super effective against flying. Yeah, I don't know why all the noises for the opponents have, have gone away. That's kind of sad. That's kind of a little tear. But Haley is immune to Sandstorms. Well, increasing evasiveness because he's a troll. I still got him. Felt that.
Oh yeah, I'll show you something wicked too. I kind of doubt it. Wow. How did that thing almost one-shot me? That was kind of annoying. Uh, I think the sandstorm should dissipate soon, so... so weird that the opponent's sounds have gone away. Nice crit, how convenient for you. Oh, well, you almost one-shotted him. And the sandstorm is still doing its thing, by the way. Withdrew, Ponyta, you coward! Wow, I like how I did it mid-move, too, so I'm locked into this move that's not gonna do crap. Yeah, good talk. Hey, I confuse you, though. Screw you. That's what you get for using the Force. Alright, anyway. Hey, you, you can, you, I can withdraw Pokemon, too, and switch to a type that's better for me. You're not special. Now, I can't do it while you're in the middle of a move like you can, but... Ha, ah, you hate yourself. Sucks to suck, idiot. Eat Flame Wheel! And goodbye. Uh, what is, oh is that like the next form of its like, of his starter, whichever, whatever that was? Yes. Well, it's water type, that's the issue. Uh, well? Yeah, that's a problem. Uh, we could go Reyna and, like, Hidden Power it, I guess. Because the problem is it's water type, and Haley is half ground, is the issue. Part dragon, but half ground, so... Uh, frickin'... I guess we'll throw in Reyna. That's why we need an electric type, dude. But we're literally on the way to do that, though, so... It's not like we're totally unprepared for it. Wow, cool looking. I like that. Yeah. Oh no, it's it's Bubble Beam on my water type. That's yeah, no. That was a crit. Oh, say it isn't so, dude. It's gonna be a slow burn kind of fight. I think we're probably gonna need to heal. Not even just Reyna, but maybe. I mean, that's thing you know it has Bubble Beam, though. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt Haley so bad, though. I feel like we have, kind of have to rely on Reyna for this fight, to be honest. All right. So maybe what we need, uh, Reyna. Beautiful. Now, knowing my luck, he's gonna get a crit with this Bubble Beam, and it's just gonna put me right back to where I was. Because the game cosmically think, thinks that that's fair. <laughs> He's like, hey, don't don't you heal. Don't do that. I hope he doesn't heal, otherwise that's gonna be really disheartening. <laughs> or I get a nasty or I get some sort of super crit, some sort of like super quad god crit that puts him to zero anyway. He's in the red, he's about to heal! I'm telling you, it's gonna happen. It's been such a slow fight, though. Yes! Well done, Reyna. Well done. That was a, I know that wasn't very exciting for you, but you got it. Alright, now try and stay in. Stay alive for me. Hello, mostly dead Ponyta. What the? We're in trouble, but there's no giving up on me. Even you shouldn't, shouldn't be able to do 30 damage to the tackle. Even the AI, that should not be a thing. What is this, Pokemon Stadium 2? All right. Beautiful. 
Well done, Reyna. Really, you really pulled us through that fight. What just happened? You're telling me I lost? Of course you did. You always lose to me. Even with, even when you have a type advantage. What? It goes to show my surefire winning strategy doesn't work. Say, hey, Scarlet, remember what I told you before? Make sure all your attacks hit. Avoid every enemy attack. I thought that was a wicked strategy, but it doesn't work. It doesn't work worth beans. I guess I have to grind it out and toughen up my team a little bit at a time. Anyway, I'm off to Solar Sion Town. <laughs> I'm off to uh, Solar Eclipse Town. See ya, Scarlet. I should just change the name every time I read that name. Uh, you'll be shocked by my growth the next time we meet. Yeah, 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 we'll see. Let's run back and heal, and then let's move towards this little, you know, sunspot town, and uh, we can, and maybe we can find a Thunderstone, because I think I remember reading that that was one of the places that a Thunderstone can be found. And I hope it's the case, because if we could find a Thunderstone, we could get Astrid having uh, into a Jolteon. And if we could get a Jolteon, that means we could have covers for water. So that particular little situation wouldn't happen again, which would be ideal. Which would be ideal, as it were. Do, 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 do. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. At least the music's popping, though. Alright. On the road again. Let me see how much you've raised your po Pokemon. I mean, I don't really see why it's any of your business, but if it's like a, a mild curiosity thing, then sure. Badoo! Uh... I can try and making this work. Really, Lexi should probably be in front for this, but... But when he w wastes moves on stuff like water sport, well... I feel a little less threatened. There he goes. I wonder where the sound went. I really missed that sound. The sound having that sound was nice. All right, so this is normal. So I think we'll throw throw a bone to Lexi for this one. I have an Eevee. Soon my Eevee will be a Jolteon, ideally. <gasps> Not that you really need type advantage against an Eevee, but you know. It's the right thing to do. 24 for my Eevee, speaking of speak of the devil. What the heck is is what is that? I don't even know how to say that. Bonsley, but Bon Bonsly? I don't even know how to say that. Rock type. Then yes, we will switch. All right, Bonsley, or however you pronounce it. <laughs> wow, I'm, I'm even faster than you. I'm just not used to that. Rain is faster than like, almost nobody. She's so slow. <laughs> She's so slow. Try to use a Pichu. Yes, we will switch. There it is. Look at the tiny little Pichu! Oh my god! <laughs> so cute. Much wow. What is like the typing with Dragon anyway? Like, did I even need this? Like, or did I just think it sounded like something I wanted? So, Dragon. So, Dragon is like not even that good. Like, in gents 2 through 5. Like, so it's normal against everything, except for if you attack Steel. So it's bad against Steel, and it's good against other Dragon. I mean, it's not that it's bad. It's not that it's bad, okay? It's not a bad typing. It's just that it doesn't have lots of advantages. It has even less than Ghost does. And Ghost already has very little. Ghost is good against other Ghosts and good against Ice. But it's bad against Steel. Well, Dragon is bad against Steel and good against other Dragon. So really, the this... If we had this, it actually takes away our need for an Ice Pokemon. Like, basically, it takes away the need for it. Because the biggest reason Ice is good is because Ice is good against... Well, actually, Ice is good against Flying, and it's good against Ground, 
and good against grass and good against other and dragon and really getting ice is specifically super important because of the whole dragon thing but technically dragon is good against dragon so having Haley gets rid of our need for I mean kind of for an ice Pokemon but actually looking at the typing though ice is good against flying ground and uh, and grass so really that's not actually true but so a dragon is not even that and that important because kind of getting an ice Pokemon kind of feels super important anyway just because even without the whole dragon thing having a protection against flying ground and grass is pretty good so we don't really need the dragon to be honest <laughs> like we don't really so if there's anything or if later on we discover that there is a typing we're missing or if there's a Pokemon I want even more we'll probably switch Haley out for something else because uh yeah, because after looking at this, like, it's not incredibly important, to be honest. Because after looking looking at the typing, Ice does ev d like, Dragon does very little. <laughs> it's neutral against everything. So I guess in that way it's nice, because if you don't have any options, going with your Dragon is probably the best option, right? If you have no other options. So it's not that it's, it's, not that it's bad, it's just that you don't have type advantage against almost anything. And you, but no disadvantages either, so having that neutral party that you know is safe against almost everything is nice, but, you know, at the same time, it's kind of a jack-of-all-trades type of situation. What is this? Oh, there's a Pokeball. Anyway, so yeah, we'll see, but still, we still want a nice Pokemon. Um, we still want a nice Pokemon because it, it gives us coverage against other stuff, but, but Haley's, yeah, it's interesting, it's interesting. That's not what I thought would be the case, to be honest. And I really should have looked before I even caught her, like, to decide if I even really wanted it. Because had I looked, I probably would have been like, oh, it's not that useful. So, I don't know. We'll see. So, the most, if there's anyone that's going to get probably traded out, if there's anyone that's on the likely list, it would be Haley. So, not, say, not saying I'm looking for a reason, but if there's a gap in the team later on, well, then Haley will probably be the first to go. Sorry, Haley, it's nothing personal. <laughs> nothing personal. Hey, great ball. That's not bad. I said that so late. If I'm using this to try to figure out if I'm synced up correctly, that's going to be really confusing. Uh, okay. So this guy is probably going to have water type. I don't really have any options, so I guess Haley is the option. Although she's part ground, though, so, you know. Hmm, a, a good rod is really good. Wouldn't you agree? I would agree. You have identical minds. Take the rod. Heck yeah, bro. Thank you. Uh, no, I know how to use it. I like how he explains it to you anyway, so like, you don't actually get the choice of telling him, don't explain it to me. He's like, nah, nah, you listen here, Sonny. You think there's anything super spicy in here? I gotta look where to catch that water Pokemon I want. I'll have to look. Wrong button. <laughs> it's never gonna be that, it's never gonna be that key, no matter how many times I hit it. What'd I get? Gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh. <laughs> it's a higher level magic cart, but it's not at all what I wanted. I knew we need the super rod, basically. Yeah, thanks. I'm not even gonna bother. You're not even gonna be worth the worth the move I'm gonna have to spend to knock you out. Yo. <laughs> Just like standing there waiting for him. I jog every morning to keep my Pokemon fit. Good for you, man. Jogger Richard. Luxio coming in with that spicy electric. Take that! I have to look up to make sure the move went off because there's no noise for some unknown reason. Uh, I guess just that again. I'm opening another one of my little mambas in case you're wondering what I'm doing. Fainted. Not that the noise would tell you would tell you that, although normally it would have. Oops! You threw off my running rhythm. My running rhythm. Sorry, man. Didn't mean to ruin your groove. All right, let's go ahead and switch. So we have Lexi and Reyna in front, and then they can handle this double battle right over here. We're tough because we battle together. We're gonna crush and munch you all up. Well, sorry, hate, sorry there, little kids. Hate to make you cry, but you're about to cry. Emma and Lil. Interesting. I can make that work. That'll work. 
Boom. There goes Mime Jr. Take that! Almost no experience for it, but that's right. Now they're both crying. <laughs> Unfortunate. It's a nerve in it. There's also berries over here. Berries! I'll take the other berry. Gimme, gimme. Gimme, gimme. All right. Uh, I'm a Pokemon. What the? Oh, it's a kid wearing a Pikachu outfit. Man, I thought I had a stroke for a minute. I was like, what? It's like, a, it's like, what is that? What are you, a Meowth from Team Rocket? Yeah, that's right. My my water type can kill an electric type. So sad, so bitter. Boy, that was really confusing for a minute. <laughs> Boy, that was that was quite something. Hyper potion, that's really good. Well, that's super bueno. I need to heal though, mostly for moves because we're a little low on moves for Dragon Rage. Okay, let's go ahead and run back and heal. Then we will continue on this little adventure on our way to get a Thunderstone. Hopefully we can actually find it. We'll see. We will see. Still though, I'm still kind of amazed that we beat that gym though, to be honest. Like, kind of amazed. Because like, we had no answers at all against it. Oh yeah. I was gonna look it up. Where do you where do I find that Pokemon that I need? Let's see here. In platinum. Let's see, where do you find it here? Do 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 Man, this song freaking slaps though. Uh, let's see, that's in the anime, in the manga, keep going. Game locations, okay. Farther back in time, please. Okay. And where's the Great Marsh, pray tell? And the Safari, it's like the Safari Zone, basically. Okay, so it's like... Uh, of the great oh isn't that where we are though hang on a minute all right so it's okay hang on we, we gotta look at the map but i gotta close all these tabs first all right hang on get me off the screen i need to, i need to look at a map isn't that where we are where's the map oh no no, 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 we are over... We were on our way to this town, going south, okay. So it looks like in Pastoria, Pastoria City is where the Great Marsh is located, and in the Great Marsh is where we can find the water Pokemon we need. So that's something. Oh yeah, there's one other thing I gotta see though, because we need a Super Rod to be able to get what we need. All right, 225 it looks like. Hang on a minute, let me see. Uh, follow the road that goes to Route 225. There's a fisherman in the gate that leads to 225. All right, hang on. So we need to look at the map again. Uh, isn't two, like 25 way over here? Because this is one of the places you can get a thunderstorm. No, hang on, that's not, that's too far. 13, 22. 
29, 30, 28, 27, 26, 25. Okay, so the super rod is quite a ways away. Getting to this city would be a lot faster, but this, getting the super rod is gonna be is way over here. All right, that's fine. We can make it work. Point is, we still we're still on track for our thunderstone, and that's really what we need. So, at the moment, that's the big that's the big chase right now. Oh, we actually could highlight the bike now. Now that I'm, we could highlight the bike. Turn on the slower speed just so we don't crash. That'll uh, speed this little journey along, eh? I really should talk to more people, to be honest. There's a wrecked stone pillar up ahead. I wonder what it is. It's got me very curious. Interesting. Alright. We already went this way. Talked to that guy. We beat those guys. Beat the twins. Uh, now that we're at our location. We got that. We got that. Let's go up this way. Oh, no. That's the dead end. Alright. Back to where we were. You wanna go? Please let me battle the Pokemon you've raised. Sure, man. You wanna battle? I say let's do it. There, Pokemon breeder. She's so cute! Grass type. Sad face, rain is in front. I did, didn't actually mean to do that. That was on autopilot. I meant to I meant to go to the switch switch Pokemon. Alright, try that again, but this time do the correct thing. Well, hello. Try that little Mega Drain move with me. See how well it see how well it does. Ah! Sucks to suck, doesn't it? There he goes. Almost no experience for it, but it's all right. Mime Junior. Really doesn't matter. We'll just stay in. But we'll just stay in. An EV. I guess we'll stay in. So cute. But it's also unconscious. There it goes. 25 for Astrid. Cleffa. This will stay in. She doesn't have anything worth that can actually threaten me. Even the tiny little Cleffa. There it goes. They, you, you, they're raised with a lot of care. She's so cute. Oh my god. Uh, hey. When I was jogging the other day, a wild Pokemon chased after me. I swear I ran on the top of the water. I was so freaked out. That's pretty freaked out. Broken, crumbling tower made of stone. Seems to be a spot where they would be a perfect fit for an old keystone. Yeah. Picked, he pushed the old keystone. The stone tower has been restored. Hollow tower is written on it. It's the hollow tower. It appears to have been built many years ago. That's so weird. I wonder what that's about. Because we found that keystone forever ago. Trippy. An ether? Never a bad thing. Uh, ooh, berries. Berries! At least we at least we found a use for that keystone, whatever it is. I don't, I don't know why restoring the tower was important, but... Just on principle, I support it. So it's like, eh, hey, sure, you know, whatever. I don't want to plant a berry. But I am a little curious to see what's inside the grass. You know, I actually saw one of these earlier uh, when I was grinding. But like, we've already had one for starters. And we don't really need a psychic type. 
Hang on a minute. Just thought I'd be sure. Alright, hang on. I think, yeah, I was about to say, I think you need more of a start than that. Yeah, alright, I didn't think so. I was almost out of the grass too, man. What was in here? A Chansey! Oh my god! I mean, Chanseys have 75 zillion health, but we don't need it. Alright, anyway. Say, honey, where'd you from? What kinds of Pokemon are you with? Easy, lady. I'm like a teenager, I think. I'm like 12. I don't know how old I am. Ah, oh, fire type. You are in trouble. Nice five damage, Scrub Lord. Ooh. Fancy folks like you have fancy Pokemon too, it looks like. Don't look down on me because I beat you. Uh, where departed Pokemon sleep. This is the Lost Tower. Well, that's dark. Hey, what are you guys doing? Oh, it's a double battle. Uh, you're not supposed to intrude on my time with Sue. Huh? You want to battle me? I will if I can team with Ty. Alright, relax, you two. Let's keep it PG. Although you're very cute. Bunnery and... The other one I can't pronounce. It's like... I don't even know how to pronounce that. Boizel, maybe? I have no idea. Boy? Yeah, I have no idea. Uh... I think Bunnery is normal. The other one's water. Hidden power on it, maybe? And then... That one is... Easy. Just get rid of it before any other... Drama happens. Hey! 28 for Reyna! Nice. Oh. Wow. Nice crit. Wow. Reyna was not joking around with that guy. I only have eyes for Sue. Maybe that's why we lost. Sorry, Ty. Don't you guys worry about it. You're too cute for this. You're too cute for this world. All right, let's switch in. Poor uh, Rain is looking a little tired. All right, we could poke in there. I mean, we could poke in there briefly. We don't have to stay if it, if it's too spooky. All right, this is where spirits rest. Please be quiet and respectful. This is dark. Oh, there is wild Pokemon in here. I was wondering if there would be. Is there what, full of ghosts? Uh, Zubat, so not not full of ghosts, maybe. Huh. I'm wondering if there's like a, something at the top of this tower, or? This is the last tower. This is a persistent fog that thickens the higher you climb. If you can't use the hidden move defog, you have no business here. There, no need to go up. I do have defog, actually. All right, I prefer to, I prefer to go heal before we go poking inside that tower, to be honest. I was like, what? Yahoo! Hey, Scarlet, I got something cool. I'll show you as a special favor. Huh? What the? What's this all about? I got some seals, but I forgot to put them on. Oh, right, it's because I was at the ruins. The ruins here are cool. You have to check it out. I found, even found a hidden machine. It was called Defog. Anyway, I'll battle you another time. See ya. You mean you'll lose to me another time? <laughs> Alright, well, it's safe to say we found the city. And I think the ruins is where we need to go, so we'll probably go, we'll heal, and then maybe we'll go look at, see if we can find those ruins. And he said something about seals, maybe that'll help in the Lost Tower? I, I, I'm not sure. I am not sure. Give me all of the berries. Alright, I think, did we have, did we have, did we have stuff to sell or no? We could go ahead and look real quick. Yo. Uh... Battle items first. Okay, do not have anything there, but uh, doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't look like it now. Okay. 
Thank you. Actually, really quick. Yeah, super potion. Can I get like five of those? Thank you. And great ball. Give me three more so I can have an even five, just in case. All right, thank you. I feel better about uh, better about myself. Your encounters with Pokemon can be considered your shared history. There is a Poketch app called Pokemon History. Use it to see your history of Pokemon catches. Thanks, man. Perhaps shows the most recently obtained Pokemon. Every Sunday, I visit the Lost Tower. Ah, yes, that's what I need. That's what I need right there. Heal me! Some of my, some of my Pokemon are kind of tired. All right. The daycare man was saying Pokemon grow at different rates. The hidden machine defog can be found in the ruins, but that my Pokemon can't learn the hidden move. I'm gonna give the ruins a miss this time. It's quite far from the town to Veilstone City. There's a cafe along the way where you can where you can get rest though. Thanks for the tip. All right. So apparently defog can be found inside the ruins even more reason to go there news press interesting Ooh. what are this nothing i can get to from this lower angle it seems wow it's like quite the quite the maze Oh, I went. That was definitely the wrong way. My my brain didn't didn't like read quickly enough what I was what I should have done. All right, I was almost on the right track. This one. Oh nope. I see what I need to do now. I need to go farther over. I didn't actually mean to go inside here. Let me out. I'm trying to get that Pokeball. Oh, really quick though. Howdy, traveling trainer. There's nothing here. Well, nothing but plenty of time to think, anyway. All right, we have the ruins here, but why not take a tour through that? Yeah, I'm heading to the ruins as soon as I can. There used to be nothing here but a road that went straight through. Over time, Pokemon and people just gathered, and the town came to be. Thanks for the history lesson. All right, not that one. It's this one. Pee-pee up. Ha, <laughs> pee-pee. <laughs> They're just like, could you not? Sorry. <laughs> could you not? I realize you have the maturity of like a six-year-old, but if you could just, you could just kindly refrain. I want to see. Can I get to this thing over here? Is this the ruins? Oh, this is the ruins. This way. Firestone. Fantastic. I don't need a firestone. Alright, so that way leads to more areas. And what does this one do? Nothing. I just want to make sure there's nothing... ...here. Alright, so yeah, no. This, this one's a dead end. Okay. I heard that the hidden machine defog was somewhere in these ruins. It's just that I seem to be lost. What with everything looking the same. Now what? I can use help here. Oh, there is wild Pokemon here. I walked for so long that I was wondering if there was. An unknown. Wow. Hey, it's very adorable, but unknown is really a not a great Pokemon. <laughs> very cool, but not powerful. <laughs> Crap, dude. It goes on and on and on. So that one's another dead end here. Okay, what about this way? What about this way? It runs into the wall 12 times. Okay, nothing in that one. All right, so so far it does look like that it's actually not as confusing as you think it is because there is a finite amount of, of tw twists and turns. Waterstone, somewhere in here. I can smell it, we're getting close. My Thunderstone is right around the corner. I can feel it. Oh, you're a trainer. 
Ancient ruins rife with the unknown. There has to be a meaning, but its significance eludes me, and that's gotten me cranky. Well, sorry to hear that there, cranky McGrumpy Pants. Carl. Oh, you have rock Pokemon. You fool. Oh, I, for I forgot that uh, Reyna wasn't in front. It's fine. Haley will make it work for this fight, and then we'll switch to... Then, then we'll switch. Because Reyna has all is neutral against, like, everything, so... His speed sharply rose. There's, there's the uh, there's the old miss. Nice self destruct. I was trying to do it to save Dragon Rage. It's there's not very many moves for Dragon Rage, and I didn't even die. Suck it. Thank you for that, by the way. If you if you had just not missed there, Haley, really appreciate the miss. That was really good. Well done. Alright, there, Reyna. Don't miss, okay? Doo -doo -doo. This is music. At least this song freaking slaps. It, uh, Bronzor. I remember seeing a lot of those back at that other place. But what is... Steel Psychic. Uh, yeah. It's part psychic, which is a problem, but it's part steel, which means f I think fire should be good, so here's hoping. Here's hoping. And I was right, baby. Carl, the search must continue. All right, Carl. Coral. Uh, let's go ahead and switch. Put Reyna in front. Haley's kind of tired now. Please. You have to like move so slow to get out of when you're when you're like running face first into a wall. All right, so that's another dead end one. Okay, what's this one? All right, but not that one. Okay, so now the only other way forward is not that way. And then, if she just hadn't ignored me, we could have turned right when I told her to. Alright, anyway, back on track. So let's try the, this one forward. Not that one. Please. Alright, let's try this way first. Thunderstone! Alright, let's evolve her. Thunderstone. Thunder. What? Astrid is evolving! Heck yeah, boy! I'm so excited we haven't had a Jolteon since Fire Red, the first playthrough. Oh my god, I love her! <laughs> I love her! That is the best sprite ever for Jolteon. Oh my god. I love her. <laughs> I'm so happy, dude. Oh my god, dude. She's amazing. That's the best sprite ever. <laughs> that is one of my favorites. That is that is the greatest thing. That is the greatest thing. Anyway, uh, restores HP if hit by an electric move. Well, that's pretty cool. Obviously, all special attack all day, baby. And very fast. All she needs now is some moves. Anyway, so yeah, we'll continue leveling her up and to give her an actual electric move. That's freaking awesome, man. That is so sick. All right, so we, now we got what we needed, and I've completely lost my train of thought on where we were. I think we came in from top right, I think. Not that way. Just want to confirm every other way first. Well, that's that was that was exciting. <laughs> that was exciting. All right, I just want to verify. We came in from this way, didn't we? Yes, because this one had the had the three. Okay, so came in from that way, which is what I thought. Now into this way. Let's just go straight first. Okay, nothing on that one. Ooh. Hey, found HMO5 defog. We need that. Beautiful. 
Found a nugget? That'll be worth some spicy money. A mine plate? Maybe it's a held item for Psychic? There's a text engraved in the back of the attained plate. The power of defeated giants infuses the, this plate. Huh. And then an odd incense. Weird. Alright. What is this stuff? So the mine plate, yep, it's a held item for Psychic type. And then odd incense. An item to be held by a Pokemon. It is an exotic smelling incense that boosts the power. Okay, so these are both held items for Psychic moves. Okay. Interesting. We don't have a Psychic type, but I appreciate it in principle. Beautiful. Well, hey, we got what we needed here. So... Now we see if we can find our way out. <laughs> Alright, that way, and then we straight across. This will bring us to the three. I think it was this way. I'm kinda... There we go, there we go. Was it this way? No. Maybe it was left. Beautiful. Just like that. That was easy. It's, that's one of those things where it seems worse than it is. But there's also that way up there, which I don't know how to get through there, because we looked at every single angle, and we didn't see it, so... Maybe there's another entrance and exit or whatever. Anyway, let's go hop over here. Let's go sell. Well, let's actually look up Jolteon for Platinum, see her moveset, to see if I should be looking to teach her a good electric move. Jolteon! And we're gonna go to... Moves Learned. Gen 4. For platinum. So, by leveling up, she learns Thunder Shock at 15, Thunder Fang at 43, Thunder Wave, Thunder and Discharge. Okay, so I could teach her Shock Wave if I find it. Okay. Alright, anyway. Hey, I need to sell some things. Nugget! Thank you. Beautiful. Well, that works out really well. Alright, now let's go heal. And then we probably could store some items. But let's go ahead and heal first. To, I think it's Scarlet's PC, and then and for decorating Pokeballs. Wow. Uh, maybe use this one, and then there we go. Move items. And no, that's not right. Pokemon, that's not right. I thought there was a way, but maybe not. Alright, whatever. Whatever. Maybe there is. Maybe the bag doesn't get full in this one. Whatever. Anyway. Uh, okay, so we got Defog. I guess we'll have to teach it to someone. And... Alright, we need to go to HMs here. And get all the way at the bottom. Obstacles are moved, reducing the foe's evasion. Yeah. It's a flying move. I don't think I have anything that can learn that. Nope. I certainly don't. It's too- I'm so- I'm so- or I'm too little, so I don't know how to battle very good. The nice daycare lady is raising my Pokemon for me. That's nice. I'm the daycare man. We look after your precious Pokemon of other trainers. If you'd like to race your Pokemon, have a word with my wife. I don't want that, but I appreciate it. Every so often, an egg will be found at the Pokemon daycare, and they're found without anyone knowing how they got there. It's an enduring mystery. Is someone leaving them there? I have no idea. Alright, so we don't care about the daycare. Let's go ahead and look at the map. Uh... I guess we should keep our eyes peeled for a 
for a flying Pokemon so we can teach them a flying move. You know, the HM we need. Secret Power Rock to. Okay, so we don't have like, a good electric move for our other character. Huh. Alright, so there's that that way, but I feel like we need to be catching in a flying type so we can go to this this uh, tower over here. I wonder if I'll be able to actually find one. Hey, look, there's a Pokeball over there. Wow, that was oddly convenient. Very first Pokemon. Beautiful, I need to catch you. I need, I need you for the flying move. Alright, just try and hit with a water pulse. See if it does see if it lifts. Take that! Beautiful! That couldn't have gone better. Now don't move so I can catch you. Thank you. Uh you think we'll get really lucky and we'll just it'll just catch with a regular Pokeball? Damn! Why is everything so hard to catch in this game? That's gonna kill itself, by the way. Well, it fought through. Hey, you little jerk, I said, get in the ball. It's gonna be even less powerful this time. Oh, never mind, it got it that time. Nailed it. Beautiful. Da 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 da. Give a nickname? Nope. I just need it for the HM, man. That's it. Alright. Steel Wing! That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Alright. Excuse me, you two. Let's go heal, and then let's give teach Defog to the Staravia, or however you pronounce it. And then let's go, maybe look, maybe look at that tower. All right, now, uh, we need to go to... Defog. Yes, get rid of a move. It's only an HM slave. Get rid of an, e an attack move that cuts down the foe's HP to equal the user's HP. Wow. Uh, double team, I guess. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I'm not keeping this thing. Hey, learn defog. Killer. Killer. All right. Let's go look at that, uh, Lost Tower. Do you think, uh, I should care about who's in front? Maybe put Lexi in front for now? Until I know what I'm dealing with? Wow, ghost, get away! Ah, help me, team! Do I look like a ghost to you? Youngster Oliver. Moth him. Well, that's very cute. I assume it's probably a bug type. Which is bad news for it. Yup. I mean, if it's weak against it, it's probably a bug. Bar. Barboach? What is that, pray tell? Water ground. Well, that's not weird at all. Uh, Frickin' Haley, I guess, because that's a weird typing, man. I don't know. See, this is kind of why having Haley's nice, though, because obviously it's weird typing. Doesn't it, that won't even slow me down? Haley doesn't care about your typing, water or ground. 
So in some ways, it's kind of nice having someone that you don't even have to think that much about. You're like, is it steel or a dragon? No? All right then. then it'll be fine. <laughs> it's kind of nice. So it's, in that way, it's really nice having Haley. It's a nice fallback option. I don't know what that is. Hang on. Normal flying. Uh, well, if it's normal, fighting will do well. Uh, I think fire will be. Well, all right, I think I think I think Lexi can uh, make it work. I was about to say it's probably neutral because I think fighting is weak. Is I think fighting is bad against flying. So. Level up for Lexi. 32 now. 26 for Astrid. Hey, you're no ghost. You would be right. There, kid. I, am, I ain't no ghost. Oh, hang on a minute. Oval stone. What is that? What are this? Uh, peculiar shown that makes certain species of Pokemon evolve. Oh, it's like a way to level up, or it's like a it's like a evolution evolution stone. What does it do? Is a held item introduced? Yeah, evolution item that allows Happiny to evolve into Chansey. That's really specific. In the core games. Yeah, I know how to sell it. Is it is it all it does really? Is it just makes happening involve into Chansey? Held by Wild Happening and Wild Chansey, 50%. Is that all it does though? That's so specific. <laughs> oh wow, that's like really specific. Alright, well. If you if you had a wild happening, or if you had a happening, you're like, man, I wish I had a Chansey. Good thing I have this one stone I need. Like, <laughs> I guess this is this is the fog they were talking about. I get. Do you need this to go through it? Cause I don't feel like you do. I can totally see. I mean, it's not as easy to see, but I can see. Just a thought. But I don't know if they would make you do it or what. I don't know. So far, there's nothing but Zubat in here for wild Pokemon, which obviously is uh, nothing we're interested in. Obviously. That makes you wonder if they're gonna have hidden items. You wanna go? My Pokemon were taken from me. Team Galactic did it ever since I have never forgot forgiven their faces. I'm sorry to hear that, bro, Chacho. Roughneck Kirby. <laughs> Cleffa. <laughs> That's not what I expected. I was like, alright, here comes the, you know, the coughing or the wheezing and Nope. It's very much a clef. And a crit, too. Because Lexi is just crazy that way. Now he's just crying. Sorry, sorry, bro. Didn't mean to... Wow, I just turned to the right immediately. Alright, Zubat. Oh, it's, it's, a, it's actually a Ghastly this time. Not a Zubat. I was just expecting a Zubat. I, I want one because they might be my favorite Pokemon possibly, but I don't need one because we, we can't get we can't get a Gengar man. We, yeah, we could evolve it, but you think like oh never mind. There is a way through, and it's a revive, which is really good. Let's go, nerd. I can't explain it. Being here compels me to battle. Well, being anywhere compels me to win. So, oh, he's so cute. All right, Pichu. Pichu, more like, you're about to lose, Chew. Got him. It's like, could you never speak again, please? It's so bad. It's like, sorry. I'll just be over here. Uh, I mean, it's electric. I mean, we'll just stay in. I don't really have anything. I don't have any better options at the moment. All of my ground types are half water or whatever. 
Or, the, or I do have like my Dragon Ground, but she doesn't have any good moves. So, you know. She doesn't have any good drag or any good ground moves, so. She doesn't have like Earthquake or anything, so it's just like, don't bother. Just keep Lexi in, mock punch it once, and be done with it. It's a big variety of trainers in here so far though. Which is kinda nice to be honest. You're it's not like grass trainer after grass trainer after grass trainer or whatever. Or what or you know, or whatever. It's just kinda nice to be able to uh, you know, battle something that's a, that's anything else, to be honest. Huh? What was I just doing? I feel like you need to get out of this t this tower, man. I think it's messing with your head. All right, I need to go to the berries and see if we can unparalyze my Pokemon. Use. Thank you. It's really foggy in here. I mean, it's not as easy to see, obviously. Like, if you could have it not foggy, of course you would want to, but I don't think I'm not. Say I don't think you need to. I need to shake off my sorrow. Please battle with me. Sure. If it makes you feel better, I don't think losing is going to help you feel better about whatever your particular issue is. But Bonsley or whatever your name is, isn't that the, that rock type? Isn't it like isn't it like rock type? I think that's not good. That's not good. Uh, Reyna. Oh, wow, well, that didn't not, that didn't do crap. <laughs> I was expecting that to hurt a lot more. It did not. Good night. Sweet prince. I'm getting like no experience with this, by the way. My sorrow has deepened. I know I told you it wouldn't help. Like, I don't know what like I told you it wouldn't help. All right, cowboys, let's go. It makes no difference where we are. If you have Pokemon with you, I reckon you ought to battle. My Pokemon is a lively one. Let me show you how much. Go for it. Two on one? It sounds like good odds. I can take you. Belle and Pa, Beth and Bob. <laughs> That's so good, though. Double Ponytaws. Which, it, it makes sense. They are, they're, they're like cowboys. It makes sense. Uh, well, I guess you can just use Mock Punch. Because obviously a fire move isn't, isn't very wise. Ah, they stomped their flat. Reyna, speak to me. Reyna flinched? That's superior. Alright, well, Reyna, well, if you want to go ahead and not flinch this time. There's one of them. There, now we're getting some decent experience. Poor Lexi, dude. Her health is in trouble. Nice crit, by the way. Hey, didn't flinch that time. And hey, we actually we actually got a crit. So that's actually like for and you know for us for you know, for a change, not against us. You've got a lot of giddy up and go in you. Well, aren't you a lively one? Yes, I am. All right. Well, Lexi is like turbo banged up. So I guess let's go ahead and put. Reyna in front, and then we'll put Haley in case there's a double battle. And for now, Astrid can continue to hold the EXP share. Because she needs good moves, because at the moment her moves suck! Return! That's a pretty good move. Hey, you two. You wanna fight me? I can't embarrass myself again, not in front of my girlfriend. I don't wanna look bad again, not when my boyfriend is watching. Both of you are about to lose, but you're about to lose as a team, which in some ways I think will lessen the blow, so... It'll be fine there, Mike and Nat. That is not what I expected. They're, they're a team to be. It's a dark flying and a ghost. Well, that's weird. All right. Uh. Well. Freaking hidden power on the ghost. And then Dragon Rage and the Murkrow. Maybe I should f be focusing them down one at a time. I don't think both of my Pokemon are going to have the strength of one shot. <laughs> Pursuit? Did he think I was gonna run? Can no longer escape. Reyna wasn't going anywhere. Yeah, that was a crit, too. Alright, go ahead and do Hidden Power on the Mischievous one more time. 
Same move, guys. Same, same thing. Well, there goes the Murkrow. So that's good. There's Mean Look. Now, uh... Haley ain't going nowhere, but she also wasn't leaving, so... Doesn't really feel like that much of a threat, to be honest. One more time! I guess do the same thing. And there they both go. Well done, guys, well done. 27 for Astrid. Aw, oh, jeez, man, that's a downer. It makes me feel hollow inside. Oh, so hollow. Oh, dear. <laughs> I think I gave, I put them into a crisis. <laughs> well, this looks like we're getting close. Did not, didn't mean to go there. Uh... <laughs> If you could do it so I could see a little bit better. Uh, do you think I should heal? Maybe we'll see if we can make it work. Because I'm a mad lad like that. Oh, the fog is gone. And with it, all my doubt in my heart. This is my thanks. Don't be shy. Take it. Spell tag. Thank you. Whatever that is. That Fantina. It's hard to tell what she's thinking. But she has a compassionate heart. You know, she's a regular visitor. Let me make your journey out of this place less frightening. Take this. They gave me some tags. Interesting. The Lost Tower is where the spirits of departed Pokemon are put to rest. Those that enjoyed long lives, those who whose times were short, all the departed Pokemon shall find solace here. That is really depressing. <laughs> like, it feels like really heavy stuff for a kid's game, you know? Ghastly, stop taunting me with how much I want one. But here's the thing to remember: the sprite for Haunter is not as good, and I'm willing in this game as in the other ones I've done. So I'm willing to bet that uh, it's not like we're missing. It's not as bad. The blow is not as bad. Nice confuse right? That, that's awesome. Anyway, hey, I actually got away. I was just trying to go up to, to switch Pokemon so I could knock it out. But anyway, um, but the sprites aren't as good in this one as uh, it, for Haunter at least, and I'm willing to bet probably for Gengar too. As in, was it the last one we played or the one before? Um, that had better sprites for Haunter and stuff, so the, whichever one that we used Serenity or Haunter on, that one was the that one was the one with the best sprites that I've seen for Haunter and stuff so far. So it's not that bad, and uh, so it's not we're not missing something as bad. Anyway, so they gave me some tags. What the heck are those for? What are those about? So the spell tag. It boosts ghost moves and a clarence tag. It helps keep wild Pokemon away if the holder is the first one in the party. Well, that's kind of nice. It would help drive away the riffraff. All right. Well, I think well, let's actually give that to someone. At the moment, Rain is in front and doesn't have the EXP share, so it makes sense. So let's go ahead and give her the clarence tag. There we go. That'll help keep away the wild Pokemon. So yeah, that's nice. Thanks, guys. Alright, so that's cool. There's, you know, there's some trainers and, you know, and some battling and whatnot. And there was a few, a few good items, so can't complain. I already beat all of you. You don't mean anything. You don't mean anything, no. Well, we're all, we, we've made it like three floors without encountering anything. So obviously it does help keep them away, but it's not as good as a repel, obviously. Go away, Zubat. Well, that was worth it. We got some good stuff in there. Alright, we need to touch up, though, because my Pokemon are kind of banged up. Kind of banged up a little bit. Alright, heal me. Alright, then let's look at a map, and I think we do need to go up, but let's look at a map after this. Figure out where we are, because we need to be working our way towards the super rod. Because I need that rod. And then we have to go south to that town I need, so we can get the Pokemon I, I want. Uh, I guess she can... Well, Haley's actually lower, so... Maybe what we'll do is continue opening the wrong bags. If I could, that would be the best. All right, give me the clarence tag, and then you switch with Haley. She needs it more. And then let's go ahead and give you the clarence tag. And 
you. Alright, good. Now let's go ahead and give it a save. Alright, now let's look at the map. Uh, map. Okay, so kind of going towards this one would work just fine. So going up and then to the right, more or less. That'll work. So let's say, do you think there are wild Pokemon in here? Oh, look at that. There's a Ponyta. I mean, we obviously don't need one. But it's still cool. I still appreciate it. Hey, my Pokemon toughened up while working on the ranch. I am right proud of him. You should be, man. You should be. Show your Pokemon some love. Ponyta, what a time to switch away from uh, Reyna. I mean, you know, Haley can make it work, but... Not gonna lie, it would be nice to have my water type in front. Ah, uh, doesn't do nothing. Ooh, good experience for that one, though. Hi, your Pokemon sure can be counted on. They sure can. Boy, you're right. And to think I had the clearance tag on. If I didn't, how fast would how much would this encounter rate be? Every tile. I just want to get level with the path. Oh, actually. I wonder if we should go to the left first. Wow, this tall grass is freaking insane with the cat with how many Pokemon are in here. Geodude, we don't need one. But I support it in principle. Hey. Oh, you're not a fight. As long as there's a road, we'll keep on running. Good for you. There's berries down there. Give me the berries. All the berries. I want all the berries. I didn't mean to skip one, but it's fine. We'll go back for it. Did you guys see the uh, trailer and stuff for the new Warhammer 2 DLC? Is anyone else freaking like stoked beyond belief? Or is it just me? Um, uh, Reyna and Haley. I guess that's fine. That'll work. Woohoo! I'll show ye I'll show y'all how tightly I bonded with my daughter. I can get away from slacking off, but if I have my Pokemon out. Man, reading I don't know why reading that was so hard. My brain just like don't understand. Ponyton Rapidash. That is um, again, we've seen those sprites before, but they're still amazing. Uh could go Sand Tomb, it's low key, but let's just go Dragon Rage. Hit the pony saw, and then you're gonna go ahead and hit the Rapidash. Gonna be honest, completely expected her to flinch. She didn't, but I expected it. Alright, y'all, one more time. Do it again. Haley flinched. Oh, I was, uh, again, really expecting to be like, Raina flinched. <laughs> yeah, less stomps for you, pal. Alright, this time, just go Sand Tomb. That way you can miss it and get it over with. Wow, that, that move, like, almost always misses, so... Beautiful. Take that. Parent and child power couldn't get the job done. Oh, sheesh. Sorry, y'all. See what I did there? Haha! <laughs> no, okay. 
I'm a rookie breeder, but I'll do my very best. I realize there's a lot back there I missed, so you don't have to worry. We're, we're gonna get them all. Magby. I think that's fire type. Which is fine. It's one of the beauties about having Reyna in front. She doesn't care about type. Almost at all. She does a little bit, but almost, almost doesn't care. Sorry, pal. Half ground. Sorry, pal. We do need to heal, though. Mostly the other issue, too, is Haley only has one freaking move. Like, she has a few other ones, but she has one good move. So that's kind of kind of the problem with Haley. She really needs some more moves. Some better ones. Wants to learn Slash? Hey, speak of the devil. Speak of good moves. Yeah, I want Slash. Slash is a great move. So, how much does Slash do? So it's physical, 70, 100. This is physical, 90, 85. So takedown is more, but uh, takedown gives you recoil, and I don't like I don't like the recoil. Yeah, give it a takedown. Plus, this one has better accuracy, and it doesn't have recoil, so... That feels like just a straight improvement to me. Well, that was worth it. At least now I have two good moves now. Alright, little Togepi. Sweet kiss, but it missed. Slashed, and that's it. Very nice, very nice. It's all right, I'm still a rookie. She's, I just love her sprite though, like more than most anything. Oh, this is the uh, cafe. Is this the cafe that'll give you rest? Hi, welcome, places my pride and joy. Oh, you're battling me. <laughs> I came in for rest and instead we're fighting. Well, hello, waitress Katie. It's so cute, look at the little Clefairy. I mean, you know, Haley's still gonna stomp on its little face, but it's still cute. It's still cute, it's not its fault what's about to happen to it. Increasing your evasiveness will not save you. That's it. That's all she wrote. I take losses with an unusually big smile. Did you find that out at all? <laughs> I mean, not not specifically. How you doing? What you having? Of course, all we ever have is Moo Moo Milk. A dozen? No thanks. Uh. Howdy, traveler. Some of our customers are rowdy types that want to battle. You are. Do what you will with them. I don't mind. I kinda just thought this was a place to crash. And it's not at all. What is with all the Psyducks? The Psyducks just are standing firm. They aren't inclined to move at all. Well, that's weird. <laughs> all right, let's go back. Let's just run back this way. We gotta heal. Cause there's lots of trainers in there. And then it's gonna take a few trips to clear them all out. It's a good experience, but you know. Experience, give me all the experience. Okay. Let's go look at our levels. Which one should be in front? Okay, at the moment that's fine. Astrid always almost caught everyone else though. She doesn't she has still has the worst moves, but Whoop! Meant to be out of the grass. I'm taking a rest. If I were a bird Pokemon, it would be a, it'd be a roost, huh? You should rest up too. Thank you. I thought you were a trainer. If they had to keep flying forever, bird Pokemon would eventually crash. That's true, man. I'm willing to bet you'd probably be right. All right. So there's that guy. Okay. Hang on, guys. I got a text, and I have to answer it real quick. Okay. Sorry. We're back. Uh, I think you can go... One more. Oh, you actually can't take your take your bike in the grass, in case you're wondering. Yay, we're gonna battle with the lots of Pokemon. Yay, we're all gonna battle. It's a bad look, man. We're about to fight these kids and about to ruin their hopes and dreams. Pikachu is the fairy. Alright, uh... 
guess just Dragon Rage. Nice crit. Yeah, how do you like that? Jerk, it wasn't even a crit. Suck it. <laughs> That's for hurting cute little Reyna. Probably panicking that he saw his buddy just get one-shotted. That is, it doesn't matter. Uh, Reyna's slower than Haley, and Haley will probably finish it, so... Yup! That is one HP it survived? Are you serious? Wow, that defense curl meant a lot, I guess. Somehow it survived it. I can't even believe that. Hey, 28 for Astrid. She's officially caught up. She still has the worst moves, and she needs an, she needs an actual electric move, but... She caught up, though. Whoop. Hey, check this out! Look at the luster of my Pokémon's fur! Alright, let's see it then. It's kind of a little bit of a weirder statement now that, uh, now that we are playing Moemon. Look at, uh, look at Elekid! It's so cute and mischievous looking. Alright, what's your, what's your second one? Let's see it. I don't know what that is. Oh, isn't that that lower form of Chansey that we were reading about earlier? Yeah, that's, I think that's what that is. Attack harshly fell. Well, that's, that's not good, is it? Hey, we still got it, though. Wow, that was a boatload of experience for that. Hey, hey, did you take a good look? I, I saw. Bro, I, I saw it. Thank you. Super Appel, that's really good. Well, that's pretty nifty. Alright, so now we have battled all the peons over there. Now we can actually poke inside the cafe. And see if there's any more of these little punks want to battle. Youngster, you've seen the Psyduck huddled outside? Psyduck and Pokemon that suffer from chronic headaches. Uh, I'm afraid we'll have to wait for them to get better. We were having a heated discussion over Pokemon the way collectors do. Ah yes, well, let's see it then. Collector. Heracross? Wow, look at Heracross. Someone's a big fan of, of, old, of old Heracross. That's, that's cool looking. That's almost a Pokemon you never see, man. Also, it has a, it's really tanky. And it has Brick Break. It hurts a lot. All right, hang on a minute. Hang on a minute, we'll deal with this. All right, Lexi. We're gonna Raffle Stomp this thing. You can't counter when I haven't hit you. Yeah, survive that. Pretty good experience. Nothing to, nothing to shake a stick at. Knowledge alone isn't everything you know. Oh, I know. Oh, I know. Don't you worry. All right, Haley, you need to switch. Go ahead and switch for Reyna for now. Whoop. All right, try that again. This time, do it correctly. There we go. I'm a collector, and I love honey. Good for you. You think he's gonna have another hair cross? Nope, Munchlax. Munchlax, I know that name. Why do I know that name? Normal, and I do know that Pokemon. Oh, uh, I wish Lexi, Lexi was out right about now. Lexi, we need you again. Lexi? Ah, oh, don't lick me. <laughs> it's kind of a funny mental image that Munchlax licks Lexi, and so she punches it in the face. She's like, hey! 
You keep your tongue away from me! Punch it again, Lexi. Nice right hook, Lexi. Very nice. It fainted. It certainly did. Not terrible experience. What what have you done to my Pokemon? It took me forever to catch it using honey. Sorry. That's the way the cookie crumbles, my dude. Alright, so the little Psyducks aren't moving, so we are uh, rightward bound, as it were. Oh, it's also raining over here. And kind of stormy. Alright. I think actually we have to go through this way. Uh, I guess having Reyna in front is fine for now. It's a tre I'm a treasure hunter. Today, the loot is a victory from you. Yeah, it looks like this is gonna elude you. You're not finding this treasure, pal. Cause you're about to die. It'll be easier if Reyna was not in front for this. A little tear. Also, it's raining. Which, actually... Maybe we should start firing off water moves while it's raining. Do more damage than we otherwise would. I don't know what that does. Oh, what are you doing to poor... What are you doing to my Pokemon? Poor Reyna. It does very little damage, even though it looks really nasty. Yes. The rain is giving me power. How to use a shield on. What the heck is a shield on? Rock steel, so water, I think. Well, no, because I think that would be neutral, but fire will be neutral too. Grass maybe would be better? I don't know. Anyway, whatever. I have very little options, so we'll just have to hope Water Pulse does it. Plus, we do have the bonus of the rain, so. Oh, no, it is super effective. We're good. I can't win. You're too strong for me to win. Ether, not bad. He'll come around. I slow down and stop at time, sure. I'm only human after all. All right, good talk, I guess. All right, so there's a... All right, so that kind of looks like where you're supposed to go. So what's this other way then? Oh, just a tree, all right. And a little bit of grass. What, what's up with the grass? What's up with the grass? Anything good? Eh, probably not pretty standard stuff well really like we don't we don't really need to be on a hard lookout for we like kind of keep our eyes open for anything good but we don't need to be that crazy about it because we have we have a slot to get rid of one of the HM slaves probably our flying type for us for a ice type and then we have getting rid of the other one for the water type we're looking for that we're on our quest for right now so really we don't need to be keeping that hard of an eye out for them because we're doing okay. Like, the team is kind of spoken for, more or less, you know? Technically, Haley could be on the block to get rid of if we, f if we find anything that's, like, life-changing, but... But otherwise... I think we're oh, probably okay. Do unto others as they do unto you. Yep, it's payback. It's good for Pokemon battles, but if you do that in real life, there'll be no end to the fighting, that's for sure. Oh, thanks, man. And a good life lesson. As I said, payback is harsh. Use it after the foe and its power gets doubled. All right, well in that case, I'm gonna switch back. Do this, and then I'm actually gonna take that Clarence tag before I forget that you're holding it. All right, anyway. So there's cut. Is there a reason why this is a thing? Is this something like really amazing lying behind this little tree, or is it just a shortcut to... Oh, there's a fight and a Pokeball, so. You come along with your heart pounding. You think you can win like that? Hia! I do think I can win, and my heart is not pounding. In fact, it's a, it's at a leisurely beat, just leisurely doing its thing. All right, Reyna. It is raining, so we do have that bonus going for us. It's her time to shine. Lots of neutral flying around. What am I gonna do about about fighting side? Because I need... Isn't flying or psychic good against good against fighting? So, let's see. So, fighting. So, flying... 
Yeah, fight, fight against Psychic. Or there's lots of neutral, so. Alright. Anyway, uh, Reyna for 29. It's pretty spicy. Wants to learn Body Slam. Sure. You can learn Body Slam. That's a good move. Uh. There's Hidden Power. What does that do? A unique attack that varies in type and intensity depending on the Pokemon using it. It is special. Then we have Mud Bomb, which is 65.85. Wait. So this Pokemon stop? Don't give up. Hang on. I, I, I did that in accident. I was just trying to look. Alright. Body Slam is 85.100. 85. So it is a lot better than Mud Bomb. Although it's Body Slam is physical, right? Physical. And technically, she's a special attacker. But when she's now, I am getting rid of a ground move, which is a thing. Maybe hidden power, because it's not reliable. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's not. But it is special, though. I don't know. Maybe you don't need body slam, because like she's gonna be water ground. So, but we also have another ground type too already. So we could cover ground for that instead. Yeah, let's just not, let's just not learn it. I don't need body slam. Give up on body slam, cause like, she's a, she's a special attacker, not a physical attacker for starters, and it's only a normal move, and like she's gonna be ground water after she evolves, so I think we're all set. All right, go ahead and do some switching here. Sorry guys, another text, Una Momentum. Alright, anyway, uh, I don't know, just Flame Wheel. It's like, I don't know, whatever, just hit it with something. Wow, that did not do a lot. <laughs> that did very little. That's, I don't think that's quite 50%, which means it's gonna survive another one. Oh, it's dampened because of the, right, it's dampened because of the rain, I bet you. It still survived, by the way. Alright, so Lexi's gonna struggle in all this rain. 29 for Astrid, by the way. Wants to learn Double Kick. Sure, he can learn Double Kick. Get rid of freaking Growl. Boo forgot growl and learn double kick. There you go. It's not an electric move, but it's better. But he's in the match up. We will switch because it's killing us. This rain is murder on poor Lexi. Dragon Rage. Survive it! Ow. But she did survive it, and that's what matters. Take that! <gasps> Alright, I will take that Pokeball now. Fist plate? There's a lot of plates. There's a text engraved on the back of the obtained plate. Two beings of time and space set free from the original one. Interesting. And is that... It says fist in it, so is that fighting? Or what? Yep, it's a fighting booster. There's a lot of fighting type guys in here, and this is not bueno for my... Not conducive right now. Check the sharpness of my fighting Pokemon's moves. Alright then, let's see it. Throw a gunk. Interesting. It has gunk in the name, I assume maybe it's part poison? If we're lucky. If it's part poison, then maybe a ground move. And that's science, baby. Really happy I didn't get rid of that ground move. Take 
Take that! You've dulled its sharpness. Boy, I sure have. Uh, hang on. Trainer tips. Yeah, alright, thank you. Thank you. If I had known. Get out of the way, little tree. I see berries back there. And I want them. I will take it. Thank you. Give me the next one, please. Thank you. Alright. So now we need to get up there. So I think. Fastest way, I think, is gonna be going. We're definitely losing ground here. Hang on, I don't know why. What have I done wrong? Oh, nothing. Alright. We did have to go that way. First frickin' block, by the way. Go away, you stupid bird. I don't need you. Get out of here. Also, it's raining. And you're cutting my attack. There's lots of this. Just waiting for the menu. All right. Can't leave. Sad face. I'm just gonna try that again as soon as it rains. This time for sure. Nope, still can't leave. Well, eventually you'll kill me, and then you'll faint me, and then I'll be able to leave. So, ha. Joke's on you. Well... I was actually trying to go up that time to fight that time, by the way. But we still got away, so I'm still a winner. Hyper Potion. It's not bad. We need to get to a place to heal, though. My Pokemon are banged up, man. And we're so close to getting out of the grass. What? A Scyther? Wow. I have, I'm not sure I've ever seen a Scyther before. I mean, it's, it's awesome, but, like, I don't need a Scyther. But I'm... But hey, it's very cool. It's very cool, but that's not what I expected to find in there. Well, at least it was something new. There's another guy standing there. I see I see you in your bandana. I wonder if we're near a place to heal. You don't know that's it. You leave me alone. Oh, look at that. There's uh, something over here. Ooh, shockwave! Speak of the devil! I needed that. Like, right now I need that. That's awesome. Man, that was... That was, uh, well-timed. Shockwave. Use. Alright, really quick, though. Uh, Badoof can learn shockwave? Why? Anyway, Astrid wants to learn shockwave. Yes, I do. Alright, so shockwave is special. User strikes the foe with a quick jolt of electricity. Cannot be evaded. Get rid of freaking sand attack. Any electric move is better than none, and I almost I don't know if it's a special or physical attacker, but I do know having any electric move is gonna be better than not having any one at all, right? So we can go ahead and see real quick, but I almost thought she was a physical attacker. So amazing. Love that sprite a lot. Oh my god, yeah. So she's special for days. Oh, it's a special move. We're good then. Yeah, she is an, an insane special attacker. Beautiful. Well, that was, like, so well-timed. Alright, well, in that case, I do wonder if we could put Astrid in front here to deal with this other guy. Hey, guy. Every drop of sweat I shed makes me that much stronger. That's like, is that, was that like a weird, like, mutant ability? As long as I'm sweating, I'm becoming more powerful. Look at Astrid! Oh my god, she's amazing! I love the sprite so much. Take that, you nerd. Wow, one-shotted. Astrid ain't fooling around. She's amazing, I love her. 
Machop. I guess we'll stay in. I don't really have anything better for this for these moves. Maybe that's what we should consider is switching out uh, our dragon for a flying or psychic, so we have something something against fighting type. That could be something to consider. But yeah, it's it's definitely a thought. It's uh, something to consider because we don't have any. We don't really have any options. Like we we can make it work, but we don't have a lot of great options. So. Yeah, we might should consider finding a flying type or a um, psychic. Not, you know, maybe not as exciting as the dragon, but at the same time, we also really could use it. Protected itself, sad face. Try again, you can't protect yourself forever, boy. Wow, it survived. Took aim. You're not gonna have enough time to take aim, pal. Protected itself. That's annoying. I mean, all you do is delay the inevitable, but it was still annoying. Take that. Wow, Master just walked through all of those guys. I should be lighter by the amount of sweat I just shed. And I wonder if, uh, if a fainted Pokemon weighs less than a, a live one. Alright, uh... You think there's anything hidden here? A Meryl! We used to have a Meryl, back in the day. It's very cool, but yeah, we're all set on the water types. We have lots of water coverage right now. Lots of water coverage and more to come, so we're we're doing just fine. HP up, that's pretty good. Now we gotta get our way through this grass. Heavily debating on whether or not even going in here was a good idea. I mean, we got we got an item out of it, right? So it's fine. It's fine. The good news is Astrid is really fast, so. It's not like having our, having, you know, Haley in front, where she's so slow. Or not Haley, is it? I think Rain actually. Where she's very, very slow, so that's good. Full heal? That's another good one. Oh, I forgot to look at what my team was. Oh no. I'll take on anyone, it only makes me stronger. I mean, for a, you know, for a double battle. I know what one of them is. I'm making the Veilstone Gym Challenge, but first, I'm taking, not making. All right, well, I'll slaughter both of you, and then I can get, I can move on. Dennis and Maya, Gligar, and Roselia. Oh, Lexi! Thank God. <laughs> it's Lexi. That's good. It is raining, which is unfortunate. All right, Shockwave and the Gligar. I know the fire is going to be dampened, but I'm thinking with times four, maybe it'll be enough. Doesn't affect Gligar. Well, that's really unfortunate, considering it's a flying type and all, but. Okay. It survived anyway because of the stupid rain. Interesting. Probably, probably poisons whoever switches in. Which is kind of annoying. Alright, you hit that, and then I guess... Take that. Wow, that doesn't do crap. That did less than nothing. It's a, it's a problem. Look at the little Ralts. It's so cute. Uh, I guess hit that and then... Does this do more? I mean, almost not. It still does nothing. <laughs> wow. That Gligar is a god among men. Like, we're just annihilating whatever comes out, because I can't kill the Gligar. 20... or 30 for Astrid. She's now ditching a lot of everyone else. Mm -hmm. 
stupid blasted rain, dude. <laughs> Look at the little licking tongue, oh my god. Alright, anyway. Astrid is just killing whatever comes out on the on the on that other side. And then once everything's dead, then we can double team this Gligar. Maybe eventually it'll die. Do it again. We're through Gligar. Why in the hell? Well, I know why. It's because I lined up a fire move, so he switched to a water Pokemon, because obviously he knows being an NPC. He knows what I'm doing being an NPC. He has access to the Force. Don't you know that works? God, I wish there was a fast forward. And that's like the best feature in the world. Now he switches to a freaking. You know he'll do. He's gonna switch back to that Gligar. Yeah, there's the uh, poison I forgot about, by the way. Well, switching just cost you, pal. Because your little whatever that is is not going to survive. Problem is, we don't have enough time. Like, Rain is not gonna be able to move before she dies. I don't even know what to do. Like, nothing is good against this thing. Like, literally nothing at all. Like, this is like. It's just a. I didn't realize one of the legendary Pokemon was gonna be so early in the game. Who would have thought? I should have switched out. I don't know what I was thinking. How do I kill you? God, your typing is just the freaking worst thing in the world. All my Pokemon are just beat to hell. I don't know. Send out the HM Slave. Uh, well. Through sheer attrition. It's almost dead, guys. It's almost dead. Somehow I failed. Don't know why. Oh my god. Freaking finally. Worst Pokemon ever. Ghost flying. All right. Well. Uh. Well, it's part of flying, right? So. And that's of course it's another one of those flying ones that are just not concerned with such things of whatever I'm doing. Doesn't affect them. Sure. Whatever. Oh, it's a normal move. Part ghost, right? Whatever. It doesn't matter. You're just a placeholder anyway. Who cares? You don't even have to do anything. You're only level 19 anyway. Astrid's the one that's gonna get all these kills. 1 HP! Why is it always alive with 1 HP? Why? I don't care. Just a placeholder. Because anything I care about that I switch to is going to get poisoned. Anything I don't, like my bird back there. There it is. <laughs> That's the reason I'm not switching to anything I actually value. I don't know. Rock smash? Do whatever you want. Yeah, what a waste, dude. I had to use a shockwave for one HP. So 
Someone's about to skyrocket. You guys were the worst, by the way. You won and I lost, but the both of us gained something from this. My confidence is crushed. Good! I hope both of you never battle again. You both are the worst. Alright, how far away am I from a town? I'm not gonna have to go back, because... Where am I? Oh, we're almost there. Alright, push through. The berries can wait. He can wait. I don't care. Man, I hope Barry doesn't talk to me. Wherever he is. I know he's loitering in here somewhere. Where's a Pokemon Center? Yay, the poison just decided not to kill my Pokemon. That's cool. Hang on, that looks, that looks like a Pokemon Center. Yes! Heal me! Sweet baby Jesus, heal me. Those last two were the worst, especially because my whole freaking team is so tired and it was raining for so long. <laughs> so Lexi is like way less effective than she normally is. I was like, come on, like she's my, well, she is my strongest and she's so much weaker than she should be. Little tear. Anyway, all right, so really quick before I forget, because I will not remember most likely if we, if we don't do it right this instant. Let's run back and grab those two berries and talk to that one guy we missed. Because I probably won't remember otherwise. Hey, I wanted to go see Celestic Town, but there was some Pokemon in the way. Who knows why they're there, but they're not budging. Yeah, the little Psyduck, who knows. Oh. Gimme. Alright, now was that actually everything over here, or was I in desperation mode because I was trying to find a way out? No, okay. Well, yeah, I think that is everything because I think we came from that way. And we and then we got that Pokeball. Okay. So yes, that is everything this way. And then there's the place where the Psyduck were, but obviously they're not where, you know, plot-wise, I don't think we're supposed to go that way, so. That is fine. Holy goodness. Oh wow, look at that. A star piece. I think that's a selling item. That's cool. A couple of Team Galactic guys over there. The game corner is dangerous. Why is it dangerous? It's so fun I lose track of time. I got a TM as a prize from the game corner. I use it to my Pokemon right away. All right, well, we know the game corner's here. S something trainer? Uh, yeah. No. <laughs> I have no idea. No idea what he's saying. I don't have, I think there's like a rock climb or something. It's some sort of HM. We do not have it. Uh, Maylene is Veilstone's gym leader. Then there's Wake in Pastoria. That's way too tough for me. I can't even come close to them. I bought a new parasol, but I don't want it to get rained on, so I watched the TV weather reports. Department store. That's cool. I came to the city just so I could go shopping. But with all the rock walls around, this, this place feels kind of cold. Alright, well, hey, that'll be a, uh, a great place to call it, me thinks. Although really quick though, one thing we should do before we actually call this episode. Let's find the, let's find the gym and see what we're dealing with. So I know how screwed I am. Blood rocks. Team Galactic. Let's see. Alright, well the game corner is up there, but we don't care about the game corner. We're trying to find the gym. Rando houses. Oh, there it is. And, uh, what's his face? Hey, Scarlet, you gonna take on the gym leader? Wow, you keep getting tougher and tougher. Me? Well, I took a look at the game corner, and... I mean, yeah, of course I've been working on my Pokedex, but... Anyway, keep it up. Thanks, man. What on earth? The ring is my rolling sea. The towering waves shaped me. Crash, crash, crasher, wake. Twice. I'm the tidal wave of power to wash you away. Put out the fire, crasher, wake. Run from electricity, crasher, wake. He's singing. You get it. Hello, dude and young lady, you're challenging the gym leader, are you? Let me tell you now, she's strong, she's young, but she's a born genius. I tried every training with her, but I was stunned by how tough she was. Whoops, better tell you who I am. I am the triple threat gym leader in Pokemon Wrestling and Song. Crash Awake at Pastoria Gym, we'll meet again. All right, so there's a fighting gym ahead. <laughs> oh dear. He's just silent. So yeah, uh, Scarlet, good luck with the gym. Thanks, man, I was thinking the same thing. That, that's that was a lot to take in. 
Maylene. Oh, the fighting gym is right here. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh, this is another gym we don't have a good answer for. Oh, that is just the worst thing. I mean, so here's the other thing is uh, I know where to find a, a psychic type off the top of my head. There's two that I know of, but at least one of them wouldn't be something we've seen before. Uh, I think... Let me go ahead and look it up really quick so I don't misspeak about the name. I think it was called... Yes, okay. So, I found a... I think it's called... Yeah, I found a Bronzor, I think is how you say that. And then, obviously, it evolves into Bronzong, I think. So, its stats are okay. It's very defensive. It's absolutely awful offense, but maybe the its evolve form can hit harder. Oh yeah, its evolve form... It evolve, its evolve form is a little more decent. It's very defensive, very tanky for a uh, psychic type, but it's part psychic. It's steel psychic, and so I found that earlier, and so we could catch one. So we could catch one um, and use it to clear this gym. We also, if we could find a flying type, that would work as well. Uh, that would work as well. I also have seen a Ralts. Um, we could get it. We could get another one. Uh, Gardevoir, or however, or however that Pokemon was pronounced. We could get another one of those. Uh, let's see. Because we at least we know that that thing is amazing. Yeah, G Gardevoir. Yeah, it's, it's, it is psychic in this gen. It has really good stats, though, to be honest. Yeah, it has really good stats though, TBH. So we could we could get another one, we could get another Gardevoir. Yeah, it is psychic, dude. It's tempting because I know I think I I don't know off the top of my head where to find these, but I know I've seen them. So I could loiter and grab one of these off camera if I was worried about clearing this gym, which to be honest I kind of am. Um, so I don't, yeah, because this is a fighting gym, and this is another another something we don't have an answer for. And we saw how difficult the last gen was, the last gym. And with that one, I didn't want to try and find anything else because I know the other poke. We, there is some typing gaps we have in our team, but we're, they're going to be solved as things evolve and as and as we catch that other water type I need. So, you know. But with this one, like technically, the our dragon Haley technically isn't necessary. Technically, so. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. It is tempting, especially because we're going to cover ground as well, is my other idea. Because when... Let's see. Let me go ahead and find her. When... Not Haley. When Reyna evolves, her bigger form is water ground. And so, the evolve form. And so, we'll have access to, like, you know, earthquake and stuff like that. And so Haley is is dragon ground, and it's and it, all the way up until it's big evolution too. So I'm tempted to put Haley back and go catch a, like a uh, and go catch a uh, a Ralts. And I know we've already had them, but I already said that this playthrough I'm not limiting myself necessarily. So as long as we have some new stuff, which obviously we do, plus our ice type is probably going to be a new one because there's lots of Gen 4 exciting ice types in this that I've seen when I was look, doing a little bit of research. So our, our whatever our ice type is is probably going to be new. And so getting a couple of repeats doesn't seem that bad, especially because it's been so long, especially for our Jolteon, obviously. Um... So maybe I might catch so off camera I might catch a Ralt to replace it with Haley and then uh, and then use it and then uh, yeah especially because I know long long term that that's the, our that you know our bird here is gonna is gonna get switched out for something else as soon as we switch to that something and then as soon as we find our other both of these two are, are gonna leave right so I know that anyone that's that has a doesn't have a slot taken like I know one of them is spoken for and the other one is is gonna be a nice Pokemon and the, this one is gonna be our water slash mysterious other typing that I don't want to talk about which I guess I could just say it's dark there we go the mystery's out it's water dark so the, our water dark type is gonna replace one and our ice type is gonna replace the other and so really Haley is the one that has to go because she's the one that doesn't really cover anything because she's neutral again everything in some ways it's nice but in some ways it doesn't give us an advantage either so I'm thinking off camera there's a pretty good chance I might go catch a Ralts and level it up and get it ready for this gym because yeah we really could use it and doing some other grinding with the other ones wouldn't be as bad but so long as we were leveling up our uh, so long as we we're leveling up the right person then it would be fine 
So that is a very high possibility that that'll happen off camera. And so you might be able to expect that. I don't know if there will be any more videos this weekend. Uh, it's kind of up in the air. We will see. Um, yeah, I, I, yeah, I don't know if there'll be any other videos this weekend, but, uh, keep your eyes peeled. There might be, might not be, you never know. And, uh, regardless, I know for sure I will see you on Monday, unless, of course, something else comes up, but again, we'll see. Uh, the only other thing I have as far as business goes, so next week is obviously Thanksgiving, uh, for us Americans. I don't think anywhere else celebrates Thanksgiving, but anyway, um, next week is Thanksgiving, and so, uh, and so I'm actually going out of town, um, and so I'm going out of town to visit my folks and my sisters and whatnot, and so, uh, there's my iPad. Anyway, and so Monday through Wednesday, I'm hoping I can record, but Wednesday might be full and I might run out of time. Um, but I'm hoping I can record Monday through Wednesday. I will be gone uh, Thursday through Sunday, and so I won't. There won't be any videos up over the holiday until probably Monday. Um, so uh, there will be a break as the holidays are going on. But that's that. That stuff's pretty normal. Um, and otherwise, though, I just want to give you warning, and I'll probably warn you going forward and up until it happens. So that way, no, nothing is surprising. But anyway, uh, I think that's everything. Anyway, that is gonna call for this one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the content today, and we will talk to you guys later.